Good afternoon. Thank you for joining us. Gina has the day off. I'm Lauren Day. We begin with some breaking news. The two men arrested in connection with a missing toddler have just been charged. Her father, Travis Rodriguez, has been charged with second degree murder. His bail set at $2 million. And also, Scott Carter, charged with hindering prosecution, his bail set at $1 million. Titana Ancog was last seen with her father, who was one of the suspects. Manolo Morales follows up. The father, Travis Rodriguez, was arrested on Saturday along with another man, Scott Carter, on suspicion of second degree murder. 18 month old Kitana Ancog has been missing for over two weeks. Honolulu police say the mother brought the child to Rodriguez's home in IAEA on January 31st. Officers went to the home with canine units after Rodriguez was arrested, but there's been no official word on what they may have found. Experts say investigators are probably looking for some type of forensic evidence in order to file charges and prosecute the two suspects. Blood spatter found on the walls or um, found on the clothing of a defendant, those type of things, they can all lead a jury of 12 fine people to come to the conclusion that that person is deceased even though the body's not found. Vanderville prosecuted the Peter Boy Kemmer case, a child on the Big Island whose body was never found. It can be done without the body. Obviously, it makes it much more difficult, but not impossible. Rodriguez also goes by the name Travis Hefflinger and has a long criminal record, including a federal conviction in which he was sentenced to 10 years. Carter was also convicted of multiple felonies. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.